just, I think, common sense to not be throwing potentially infected items all around a neighborhood. Their neighborhood littered with PPE and it's raising health concerns as communities begin to reopen. I'm sure you're thinking, how hard is it to just throw away used masks and gloves in the trash? Not very hard, right? Yeah, you'd think, but uh, one community says it has become a problem and it could be spreading the virus. Michelle Newell brings us their story. Getting rid of a mask or gloves isn't difficult to do at all, but not everyone is doing it. So it's a problem I not only took to city officials, but also the state health department officials. Put them in the, in the garbage and then please wash your hands. It's a simple answer to a national problem, but not everyone is taking heed to what Pennsylvania's Secretary of Health told Channel 11 after we asked her about a major issue. I see gloves, I see masks. You see it in neighborhoods all across the city of Pittsburgh. It's just really discouraging and depressing seeing all of the trash everywhere. On a drive around the city, we saw gloves and masks on sidewalks, streets, grocery store parking lots, even noticed a woman getting rid of a mask that appeared to be thrown in her front yard. I just saw that I was surrounded by trash. Mary Whitener is not only tired of it, she's doing something about it. It's got to go out of our neighborhood somehow. She started this Instagram page documenting her efforts to keep Pittsburgh clean. Once COVID-19 hit our area, Whitener began to tackle a different kind of litter. If I have a glove, I'll just use a glove to pick it up and get it out. I've seen it along the streets. Of the Jessica Lavecchia lives in Lawrenceville. Her daily walks are troubling. I think in like a 15 minute period, I saw about 20 to 30 gloves. She is expressing her frustrations and spreading awareness. It's very animated. Through art. Just somebody walking down the street and they notice a couple gloves. And then in the next one, they're noticing some masks on the street. And the last one is just like some guy just freaking out because there's gloves and masks everywhere. In Cranberry, we spotted this sign on a Walgreens trash can reminding people to put used gloves and masks where they belong. I think the city needs to be proactive and they need to educate people even though it's simply just throwing your stuff away. They need to help pick up things. I contacted Mayor Bill Peduto's office about the problem. A representative told me communities across the nation are experiencing this problem because of massive PPE use. The mayor's office is asking residents not to litter and to be mindful of the health of others and also be mindful of the health of public works personnel. I'm Michelle Newell for Channel 11 News.